Hey there, Stuart Donaldson here, martial arts instructor, exercise physiologist, child development authority, and most importantly, I'm a parent just like you. And today, we're gonna to look at how does martial arts help kids to focus better. Shiny object syndrome is real. There's always a new game, TV show, toy, or something to take our attention. It's literally, literally people's jobs at Facebook and Instagram and those social media companies to be able to capture our attention. But they do that, and they keep us focused on Facebook, but they give us a constant barrage of new content and different content uh, to keep us in that app. So it's not that we're on Facebook and we're focused on Facebook for an hour. We've seen hundreds and hundreds of different pieces of content for just a, a few minutes each or a few seconds each even that keep us engaged. Uh, and we're gonna to talk today about how does martial arts teach your child and teach you to maintain focus. So how does martial arts improve focus? Two ways, long term, short term. In the short term, it helps kids to stay task focused, to block out distractions around them, whether that's other kids who are noisy or moving or doing the wrong thing, uh, or external noises. Maybe they're in the classroom and a plane flies over or the janitor's on the mowing machine or there's just distractions are plenty really. Uh, and it helps to keep them focused on the job at hand. In martial arts classes, as instructors, we've got to keep them on task for performing their techniques, uh, for listening to the instruction of what we're talking about, um, for our life skills and our mat chat. Um, whether they're in competition or at grading, being able to focus and ignore the pressure, ignore all the people around them, uh, or maybe they're actually you know, sparring, either sparring you know, in class or in a fight for real. You need to be able to focus on the task at hand. Now, focus is one of the big things that parents come to us as martial arts instructors wanting their child to improve. Uh, and basically we know that students who stick with martial arts for even a, a small amount of time are better learners, better listeners, they perform better on tests, they do better at school, better on assignments, and just overall become better students and uh, therefore are able to achieve more uh, through their life. Now, in the long term, martial arts help students to focus on, on tasks and goals that are you know, months and years ahead. Uh, many martial arts have gradings you know, several times a year or a few times a year, uh, but also the long term goal uh, of achieving a black belt or achieving that, that high rank depending on, on the style of martial art means students need to focus on, on that long term, long term goal setting and you know, what they do today, tomorrow, this week will impact what they're doing in a month's time, in three months' time, in a year's time. And that correlates really well to, to education and to life. Picking up those basics in you know, your early years of school, learning to spell, read, write, and numbers, translates into you know, being able to uh, talk in sentences and write sentences, which you know, leads on to being able to write essays in high school and, and university should they, they decide to go that far. So there's a really strong correlation between martial arts or focusing in martial arts and being able to focus you know, in school as well. We have a concept we call dinner before dessert, and basically what that means is that you need to do the hard stuff or sometimes maybe the boring stuff first before you do your fun. And that means you know doing your homework before you go to the park and play with your friends, doing your martial arts practice before you sit down and watch TV. Although that second thing, that dessert, sounds a lot more fun, uh, sometimes you've got to do the hard stuff first in order to get the result. And by training in martial arts, it helps you to focus on those important tasks and being able to differentiate between what's most important, what's a want, uh, and what is a need. So there you go guys, that's my summary on the couple of ways that martial arts helps improve focus. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Next time I've got a video come out, we can have a conversation about whatever that topic might be. But for now, I want you to comment in the boxes below. Let me know, have your child done martial arts? Do they have issues focusing? How do you help them focus? I'd really love to hear from you. We can have a bit of a conversation about uh, different ways that we might be able to help with that focus. But for now guys, that's it. Take care, much respect.